What is up, YouTubers? Johnza here, and welcome back to some more Pokemon Black 2, the Hunger Games version, where, if you don't know the rules, if a Pokemon on my team dies, they go into the rip box, and then and I can't use them after that, but I can't, I do have five random revives that I can revive them at any time, but that's it. That is it. I cannot revive them any more times than that. Well, not for each Pokemon, but like... For, like, the entire whole Pokemon team that I have. So, anyways, I did a lot of training, as you can see. I got Aura and Ham up to level 15. I didn't worry about anybody else, because they weren't really going to be that useful in this first gym. But I am ready. I am ready, because the two Pokemon for the gym are level 11 and 13. And I went for Ham and uh, Aura, because Aura's a fighting type, and... Uh, the next level Ham will get, he will become a fighting type, which will be good. And by becoming a fi uh, fighting type, that means evolving into Big Knight. So, yeah. Anyways, we're going to go back to the uh, first city. I just want to start back from the other city, just in case there's any dialogue with in the way. Because I don't think I went back to the actual town here yet. At least I don't think. I don't know. It's been a while. But, uh, yeah, we're gonna go and challenge the first gym and get our first badge. And I did a lot of training so I would not, like, so I wouldn't fail at all. But here we are, the first gym. Uh, I think what I might do is have Ham up first, just so he can get that experience and evolve faster. I did get him kind of, a, like, halfway through his level 15 to get to level 16 faster. So, you know, we might be able to do that. Okay, so here's the school. Hello! Alright, so here's the gym. So I guess it's just past this way. Well, there's Sharon. Hello, I'm Clayton, the guide for the trainers who challenge the gyms. Uh, thank you for taking on the gym. Take, take this to commemorate your debit. Alright, so we get some fresh water, a healing item, obviously. Alrighty, uh, Pokemon gyms are f facilities for testing trainers' abilities. Oh yeah, I've trained for this, don't you worry. I'm probably going to also look at the Pokemon and their levels before I actually take on the gym. That's what I did be here, because I know Sharon has a level 11 Petrat and a level 13 Lillipup. So that's why I prepared. You must be the challenger. Welcome to Aspert City's Pokemon Gym. I'm Charon, the gym leader. And well, maybe I'd better say that I'm becoming a gym leader, became the gym leader. More importantly, we need to prepare before welcoming you to the gym. We have two challengers you take on. Please take your places. If you can defeat these two, then I'll be your opponent. Alright, so yeah, we'll probably have to fight him. But of course, I'm gonna go... Oh, okay, I I can't just run past him. I just have to... I have to talk. Okay. Alright, so obviously I'm going to use Ham so I can get that uh, level up. Alright, so we have two Pokemon to start things off. And yeah, uh, when I was training, like, of course, the only highest level was, like, level 7, so... And it didn't really take that long. Also, I got a uh, Ham to have learned Flame Charge, so that's something. And, uh, yeah, I also leveled up Aura to level 15, because that's when uh, he learned Focus Palm, which was very helpful. And already a first hit. Damn, look at that. And then we have Lillipop. Uh, we'll definitely keep battling, so we can get that level up. Alrighty, let's go for another Flame Charge. Am I worried? I ain't worried. I mean, look. Oh, I almost got him in the first shot again. But look. Uh, look, what is he doing? What is he doing? He's just lowering my defense. You're not gonna have a chance to attack me anymore, dude, because I'm gonna get you with another flame charge. And you get wrecked. Alrighty, and down you go. 92, and we're so close. But this next battle will definitely get us to the next level for sure. Uh, if you could defeat the girl, too, you can challenge the gym leader. Plan on doing so. All right, let's go, you and me. Let's fight. Let's get, let's get my ham to evolve. 
It'll also be the first evolution in uh, this game, too. Oh, we're starting off with Lillipup this time. Hmm. It, it, interesting, interesting. Alrighty, let's go ahead and use Flame Charge. I like Flame Charge a lot. It's very useful. Ooh, survived a little more. Okay, you just identified me. But can you dodge this? I bet you can't. Just watch. Oh, oh, what's that? You get wrecked. I really overtrained. And there we go, level 16. It won't evolve until the end of the battle, but since we had Aura come up and train for a while, we might as well have him come out and use his fighting type moves. Because it's a normal type gym, and we gotta use our fighting type moves eventually. Alright, so definitely, yeah, so this is what I have. I have Force Palm, Quick Attack, Faint, and Endure. Endure is the only one I can't attack with, but it does make it so if I use it, I won't get killed right away. So that's, that's something good. Okay, so bam. And you're dead. Ah, oh, yeah. Now let's, let's get that evolution in, baby. Let's get that. Pretty good by you. What? 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 Okay, wait a minute. Wait a minute. I was wrong. He evolves at level 17. Motherfucker. God damn it. Well, still, I think I'm gonna be able to win this gem battle anyways. Fuck me. I thought... You know what? Okay, Aura, you're gonna have to take the lead on this. God damn it. Oh, well. I think I think I could still handle Sharon without two little fine types. Alright, let's go for this gym battle. It shouldn't be that bad, because it's a level 11 and a level 13, so I should be able to take care of them easy peasy, lemon squeezy. Alright, so here we go. We got Patrat up first, level 11. Let's go ahead and use Force Palm. And it's a one hit kill, so that was good. Now, I think. I don't know if they added it in this game, but I'm pretty sure they did, and just listen. Oh. It's different, damn it. I mean, it, they added... It is kind of the same music, but it's a different sound effects for it. I don't like it. I like the first game's version better. Alright, Force Palm. Oh, you didn't even have a chance. Aura with the victory. You know, I'm proud of you, Aura. I'm not proud of you, Ham. You, you didn't survive. The battle has made me feel really glad you were my first challenger. As a gym leader, I give you this honor of the, my strength you and your Pokemon showed. So we got the basic badge. Funny, because this is the same badge little Nora gives, too. Yeah, we kind of get a different variety of badges in this game as well. Kind of. Here is your first gym badge, the basic badge. This is an important, uh, Miss Milestone. Uh, which, this badge, Pokemon up to level 20 will obey you, including trade Pokemon. And I want you to take this. Work up. Which I guess we never got a chance to see. Because I just went KO'd them both. Uh, when you use work up, battling it raises the uh, user's attack and special attack. Which I'm probably not going to use because I just go all, all force. I don't up my status or anything like that. Alright, so we got our basic badge. So that's done. So, which means we can probably move on. Alrighty. And we did get some money. So at least now, finally, I can get more stuff. Like, maybe more Pokeballs so I could get that Sun Kern. Hey! Hey, what up? Uh, how was it? How did your Pokemon battle with the gym leader go? 
Oh, if it isn't the basic badge. Yeah, I got it. It was pretty easy, I gotta admit. Wow, amazing. It's just a set-off on your journey with your Pokemon. You definitely have potential as a trainer, I'm sure of it. As for me, the, it's a, the TM for the move Return. Oh, you gave me Return, okay. Return's actually not that bad of an attack. Uh, when a Pokemon you knows Return, the more it gets along with its trainer, the more powerful the move is. Huh, interesting. Uh, still, that Charon. Bianca! It's been two years, hasn't it? Wow! What's up? I thought it would be a good idea to register each other in the extra evers. Oh, thanks. Uh, now you can communicate with me from your ex transceiver. Me too. Oh, thanks. I registered uh, Professor Juniper's for you too. Oh, speaking of Professor Juniper. Yep, and I guessed it. <laughs> Hi there, Jonza. I'm Professor Juniper. Bianca told me you accepted the Pokedex. Thank you so very much. Uh, thanks to you, we will all know more about Pokemon and be able to get along with them even better. Hi, Professor Juniper. Really uh, interested over here. There are so many Pokemon we couldn't prove were here two years ago. Which are probably the other ones from the other regions, obviously. Thank you for going so far to this Aaron Bianca. Ugh. And Sharon, how are you enjoying being a gym leader? Professor Jennifer, it's been a long time. I'm glad you're doing well so well. The gym leader position is very tough. If I had my usual partners Oh Sharon. Having battles that Pokemon come to a wire will make you a gym leader who depends the bond between your challengers and their Pokemon, right? Yeah, if you had if you had all the Pokemon you had, that wouldn't be even fair. I'd be like, you know what, screw this, I'm going to the other gyms. <laughs> It'll be fine. Sharon's a new gym leader, and I'm an assistant Pokemon professor. And John says a new trainer. But we always have Pokemon by our sides. That's right, Bianca. Our world is a world where we live with Pokemon. Everyone, keep that in mind as you pursue your dreams with your Pokemon. Uh, part, part, uh, you, Jonza. Uh, the Pokedex may be important, but first enjoy your journey with your Pokemon to your heart's content. Thank you. Hey, Jonta, isn't Professor Juniper cool? If you talk to her on the X receiver, she'll uh, evaluate your completeness of your Pokedex or tell you a lot about Pokemon Evolve. And uh, you can call us, too, of course. Uh, I'll tell you how your Pokemon are getting along, okay? Uh, Bianca makes a good point. Oh, okay. Well, actually, that would be kind of useful if I can talk to you, because then I can see how Rio or Aura is with me and see if he's very happy. And then that would also mean he's getting close to evolving, too. Uh, and Pokemon abilities and, and Pokemon type matchups. I don't think I'll need your help. Oh, Wolf, it isn't my rival. Are you the gym leader? One, two, three, let's battle. You look like a tough trainer. Understood. Please come along to my gym. Shouldn't you go to the Pokemon Center? Oh yeah, I forgot I named him Hunter. What was that? A weak answer? I'm definitely going to make take you down. I hope you did a lot of training. I had to do a lot of training. Uh, gym leader is even harder than I imagined. Okay. Goodbye. Oh, well, cool. Uh, sure. Anyways, yeah, uh, We'll get to this in the next video. See you guys.